Hi, everybody. Hi, there he is. It's Nino and Vinny. Vinny's mom. How you been, man? Good? Oh, let me give That's Jim Norton. Hey, look, he's saying hi to you. Hey, I see you guys on TV. Look at you. I know, right? Vinny, take a seat right over there. Sit right up. Pull up a mic. We'll talk about the show. The show called The Show with Vinny. Hi. Vinny's mom, look at she's adorable Jim, sitting Jim there. I love it. Nino, you look great. You lost some weight, didn't yeah, yeah, you? Did bit, look yeah. at you going fucking Hollywood. <laughs> now yeah. he's going Hollywood on us. Very That's nice. Right. How much weight you lose? Uh, about twenty pounds. I'll be on twenty purpose. pounds. He's tan. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Look at this he's guy. With his his wife. Uh, like, whatever. Yeah, he's like, like all vegan like, and shit. Yeah. You know, oh yeah. You're a not vegan? Go, not going flea, go, not that. Uh, when flea, you mean you're a furry. You look like Gotti. <laughs> fucking looking good. It looks like a stop sign. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's got some color to him. That's yeah. nice. Being vegan, you can get no fat, though. No penis on. This is from California. Oh, yeah? California there. Yeah. A natural uh, suntan. Eat all, eat all carbs, though, when you're, when a lot of vegan, like Patrice quit at one point eating yeah. meat, and he got fatter because he was just eating all carbs Every and bread. Every vegan and a person I see like that are, like, mad chubby. I'm like, yeah, yeah, at least you chubby. You have an excuse not to eat bad Blue shit. Not, right. uh, bread and pasta, you know, which is hard for me to do, but... Why'd you do it? Uh, I just want to feel healthier. You know? Yeah, yeah. how's it working that, out for yeah. you? All right? Going, yeah, you yeah, got yeah. a stroke, too, right? Yeah, yeah, we got a stroke. That was 10 years ago. You had a stroke? That was 10 years, yeah. How That's, bad was it? Bad, very bad. So what, did you feel it when it was happening, or did you just wake up and they told you? No, I felt it coming on. What did it feel it like? Uh, numbness and weakness, kind of... Dizziness. So what you feel every day, right? <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> numb, weak, and dizzy. You were in the car. I was in the car driving. Oh, jeez. Bounced off a few cars. Maron. Where, where, like, so how did you get help? Did you pull over and tell someone what was happening? No, it was right by my house. So I pulled over in the driver and... Uh, he told the hookers, like, uh, listen. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Sorry, about goes, I'm amazing. <laughs> Now, uh, the, the, the show, no, of a, course. That's history. That's history. No, oh. that's curious because oh, you, you, you live through it and you're obviously fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, I was in pretty bad shape. Yeah, how long were you out for? Uh, I, I was guy. in real shape for a couple of months. Yeah. Damn. He still yeah. walked this way wow. with the Kent's the cane. Oh, oh, oh that's shit. the cane. Okay. Hey, my whole right side was all like. Yeah. Well, your whole left. <laughs> my whole left. My left. Yeah, <laughs> tell him. Tell him. To... But you recovered you know, everything. My, oh. You know, my whole left side. I lost my old friend of mine. Was in a car accident. He uh -huh. Lost my left side. Yeah. Now he's all right. You know? He's all uh, right. He's all right. <laughs> 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 he's all right. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I came a long way. If we just pull your mic out a little bit so we can hear. Now, who's uh, <clears throat> now now who's <clears throat> whose brother are you, by the way? Right okay, so you guys are brother and sister. It's okay. not a fault. It's not a fault. All right. Happens, yeah. Was he was he was he always like off the wall growing up and everything? Yeah. Always. Yeah. Middle child syndrome. Oh really? What? Yeah, he, middle child middle syndrome. Child middle child syndrome. syndrome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Potty train syndrome. Uh huh. Rough time with that. Everything syndrome. Yeah, so wait, middle child, because because you obviously wasn't the youngest or the oldest, so he was always being louder for attention and for to get people. She's to the him. middle of the, out of the six of us. She's the middle of the girls. I'm the middle of the boys. They didn't ask you that. They asked who. Yeah. So we, yeah, we didn't ask that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, what are you well, doing? Thanks, buddy. Pay attention to your this sister. So Hollywood, man. He, he really has. Here. Look, coffee's coming Most in now. Sweet. He's totally uh, different than he was when he first came in yeah, here. I was, on the, I was on the red carpet. Imagine a red carpet. Yeah. And, and I'm going to be on that flying carpet. Yeah? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so how did, how did they convince you to, to do a, a TV show? Did you want to be in the spotlight or no? Let me say uh, I really didn't see anything coming. You know, I... um. I mean, Vinny had asked me, if, you know, told me about the idea, and um, I said, fine. Yeah. You know, whatever you need me to do. I mean, I'm always cooking, and we always have family over, and so I just figure, what's a couple of more 35 people, you know? Right. A couple of more 35. <laughs> she doesn't know what's going on. Yeah, she yeah. cares about what people want to eat. She doesn't yeah. know who any of the celebrities are that come over. No, oh, you don't. Neither yeah. does he. I had no clue. Now I know who You are, think he I... knows? <laughs> no, you don't know. Yeah, right. I don't know. Yo, I know, I know, I know Mark Wahlberg from the movie Ted. You know, that's why I know, that's why I know. <laughs> just from Ted. <laughs> from Ted, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no clue. Well, yeah, clue. you have Mark, you have Kesha. Kesha, yeah. Kesha's been a on. Nut, she's a, off yeah, the wall, off the wall. Off the wall. Are you supposed to be cursing? Yeah, yeah. You oh, yeah, yeah, you yeah, could yeah, curse yeah, on this, this one. Does your mom? Uh, uh, do, you do you mind the cursing? Show. Right. Joe Brady's fucking. 
No, I don't mind it. No, yeah, I mind it. No, you don't, you don't mind it. The other day, she was she was uh, the, the New York Post wrote like a bad review, and they oh, started shit. making fun of her. Oh shit! And then someone saw all I hear is someone telling her, and then I just hear her go, "Fuck them." I actually said. Say it. You said, fuck them. Fuck her. Oh, <laughs> fuck oh. her. <laughs> fuck her. What she was it? She made fun though? of my hair. She made fun of me. She said, I was brought up in the Roosevelt. What did she say? Maybe? Roosevelt theory. What was it? That fucking Stasi? What's her yeah, name? Yeah, yeah, Linda Stasi. Stasi. Linda Stasi. Yeah, yeah. She had no like, fucking risk. She's probably bald. She's like, he, he doesn't <laughs> need bald, his mom. She's probably bald, that fucking old lady. What did she say? He doesn't need his mom to succeed. Whoa. Anyway, she's from like the Roosevelt era. She looks like she's at, right out of the Roosevelt no, era. Oh, oh man. She, that be said something about me. Like, I woke up with my shirt open. Oh, that he, fur, he, he glorifies the stereotype. The Italian stereotype. That's what I do. I don't fucking bitch. <laughs> and what? I think she's a paisan well, too. You shouldn't yeah. make yeah. fun of somebody's mom. Exactly, <laughs> right? Uh, moms she's have. She's obviously not a mom, right? Uh, mom? Probably not. I no. hope not. Not with that no. job. <laughs> exactly. You know what? Yeah, moms get a pass. Yeah. They get a pass with everybody. You don't goof on moms. Yeah. How was so, little Wayne? Little Wayne was like super respectful. Just yeah, like sweetheart. when you bring anyone around a mom, they right. become like little yeah. boys. He took off his hat. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Yeah. Did he offer us some scissor? No, nah, we didn't drink the scissor. This was pre scissor, little Wayne. <laughs> he wasn't on drugs? The only thing I told him, I told him. Probably, but I don't know. I told him, 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 Yes. Did you did you have any reservations about opening your house up to to these people? No, I I really did not realize. Not that I didn't realize. I, you know, it's a big old house, and I raised you know thirty years with them, and I yeah. raised my my kids there, and. Um, See the thing is, it's not I'm, a fancy house. Yeah, you know, I never even and, had friends come over because yeah, it's a tiny it's house. Oh, my, my apartment. God. We have yeah. one bathroom. You live in an yeah. apartment, basically, and. Yeah. Uh, and then it went from that to being the set. And then yeah. I told MTV and everyone, I said, you know, there's other places. We go to my aunt's house, yeah. you know what I mean? Uh -huh. I'm buying no. a new house. We can go to that one. They're like, yeah. no, we want this nitty-gritty, raunchy right. apartment right, right here. It's not then, raunchy, Vinny. Oh, hey, Vinny. <laughs> Come on now. Uh, but when it's tight. It's tight. Tight. It's tight. Like, How many people live in there now? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but... You know what it is? We never had like uh, we had, yeah, why? They had their own room. Smarten up, I'm motherfucker. But I had my own room, but we didn't have like a living room. It was just the kitchen. Yeah. You know? Everyone, like you, like you walk into the living room, then all of a sudden they're in my mother's room. You yeah, know yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Railroad boy. rooms, you know. Yeah, you can Each tell it's very small. small. Yeah, but we right. made my sister's but, room, the green room. Yeah. We made my mother's room, the dining room. Yeah, they turned... And we put lights in. There's lights hanging up in the ceiling. Now, yeah. how often do you is yeah. is this intrusion on your every life day happening? For two it's every day for two months. Yeah, not every day, but we go according. Like sometimes yeah. four times a week. But you can't really break everything down and and. No, it stays up. So it stays up. Yeah, so that's what I'm yeah, so she's yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so actually, I bought a new house with my yeah. Jersey Shore money. Nice. So and then uh, we run away. So. At the same time that we were filming, uh -huh. we were sleeping in the new house. Oh, okay, but it's that like works. an empty house. Just how big is it? Yeah, empty. it's pretty. It's like it's a decent size. It's bigger than this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Staten Island. Yeah, I bought it for <laughs> me, my mother, and my sisters, and I live in the downstairs. Uh, oh, now you, man, why do you nice. live with your family? Because you're a successful guy, and uh, I mean, I lived at home until I was thirty. But do you mm. just like living with your family? Yeah, I mean, I yeah. don't know. I wanted to, like I said, I wanted to get them out of that little right. apartment, you know, yeah. and I don't have it like that where I can buy them a house, right, and me a and house, you a and house, everything. sure. So, I kind of bought a house that has two houses in one. Like, mm -hmm. I live in the basement. I made it like a sick you apartment. You still live with us. No, Where ma. Where are you going? It's a very, <laughs> it's a very Italian thing to do. Yeah, yeah but I soon mean... I want to get out there and get my independence. I just travel a lot so much that yeah. I I end up coming home and I want to just eat my mother's cooking, do yeah, my laundry. Yeah. And do the laundry. Yeah. <laughs> does, does mom do your laundry, laundry or do you do it? No, yeah. my mother, mother does it. Your mother does I laundry. Mama's boy. Yeah. 100%. I can't yeah, but wash this. It smells like shit. You probably leave in the washing machine too long. I guess. Don't no watch in the fucking toilet. Don't watch in the toilet. Don't watch in the toilet. Smells like shit. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> he said, "Don't watch the clothes in the toilet if it, it smells like, like shit." shit. <laughs> See? I don't mind. And I don't need a resume to go down. I just show up when the food is served. I show up to eat. You just show up. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know how we got on no the show. Resume. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, now are you cooking every night? 
This is an every night you cook. Now, would you normally cook every night? Yes. or? My wow. Kids, she cooks during the day, you. too. Yeah, day and night. All... Day and night. <laughs> but she cooks for, for everyone, the crew. Like, she'll, like... Wow. And not, and they don't want her to. They actually have real catering. Right. But she'll, like, just in between takes, like, start frying up <laughs> potatoes and eggs and <laughs> making little Nutella sandwiches. <laughs> and it to people. Yeah, you know what it is? I'm comfortable she when I'm doing that. Right. So... It's just, it's a good, like, I don't pay attention to the cameras. I don't, you uh -huh. know, that's my, <laughs> that's where I'm like, comfortable, you, you know? like to cook. I like to pasta, cook, and I yeah. like to people to be happy with what right. I, you know now, what I, I mean? Right. Now, are you, the, are you the mom that just would never sit down at family yeah. dinners, Absolutely. always up, yeah. running yeah. around? Yeah. They yeah. never yeah. sit down and enjoy the never food themselves. Right. My that's kids just tell like, me just 30 like my years, they've never, never seen me eat. I don't no. think I've ever sat down with her at a dinner table. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Never. I know exactly what you're talking like about. Like me with yeah. my mother. She never sits down. Grandma. Never. How many people normally, without the TV show, would be eating at your house on a Sunday? Uh, on a Sunday, whenever, like whenever 30, your night is, 30, like 30, 30. Or every we're Sunday. We're a big family wow. with six kids. <laughs> every Sunday, <laughs> everyone yeah. comes over. Yeah, every, yeah. every Sunday. Wow. Yeah. You we're, to 30 we're people. six kids and we well, all have children. Right. We're all it's all the sisters children. and the grandmother. And like, now there's grandchildren, you know. Oh, right. you mean your brothers and sisters, too? How, how many of you yeah, are there, Benny? Yeah, yeah. Three of us. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, and then every, then there's six of them. And each one of them has kids. And then they started to have kids. How do you fit that many people? It's not in our house. We do it in my house. We all live in the same neighborhood. Oh, okay, so you go to like aunts. Aunts. Right. Aunts, yeah. Sure, Each sure. Other. Oh, so you do yeah, it that way. Do it I live a little further away, but I still make uh, it. Raunchy. I managed to get there. I still I live far, but I managed yeah. to get there. Do you have any kids? Yeah, yeah he boy. does. And you his son? Old? He has a beautiful son. His son is like straight edge, going to school to be a dentist. Beautiful. <laughs> He's like the smartest kid in the world. All he does is study, doesn't yeah. go out. Yeah, does, he, does, yeah. does he roll his eyes at his dad a lot? Yeah. I guess. Yeah. How many times How many times has your son said if someone's like, who's that? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never met that man. <laughs> he just goes like this all the time, Blaze. He goes... <laughs> Shakes his head. Yeah, yeah, poor kid, yeah. Poor kid. It's not his fault to be my son. I love the dad. He's, he's in college. Yes. Yeah, he's very like young college. Smartest kid ever. It's Four so weird. Average. Uh, yeah. I and would, then I his would. and then his girl that he lives with yeah. is like this Buddhist. Like massage therapist who's like all one with the earth and environment and then who meditates she and chants. Day, yeah, but I tell day, you, Benny, she's his. He's her. Um, project. You know, in life, every project. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, <he's>, uh, <laughs> yeah. She wants to go to heaven, so she's you know. So she's, yeah. She's, where'd yeah. you where'd you, where'd you find her, Nino? Huh? Where'd you find her? God, huh? it's, so it's a long story. It's a long story. You he was like her like a little pool boy or something. Yeah. Ah, he used to cook what? for her and do things around the house. Ah. Yeah. And then she like eventually just moved him in. And, she, and he hasn't I'm paid a big, for a thing in 10 I'm a, I'm, oh, a great, I'm a great cook. She lived alone for years, for 17 years. Uh -huh. So she says, yeah, I can take care of your back with a massage therapist. She's very good at what she does. She's been doing it for 35 years. Yeah. She says, I can help you with your back and you cook for me. So I don't have to go out and have to dinner. Yeah, it's a punisher. So you were her punisher. So, <laughs> so I, I cook. For, I cook. and uh, You can I, cook? I, I, I am a, I'm a great cook. Yeah, I mean, I, wow. I could joke around. Right? I, I, I was a cook. I worked in a nut. I worked in a nut. In a nut. I was a cook. I sold soup to nuts. You, know? you, you worked soup. in the same asylum? Yes. yes. <laughs> soup to nuts. He said he, he served soup to That's nuts. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. You know, you oh yeah but you don't God. speak English, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you need to, they don't nice understand you. I soup to nuts. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Oh, so, my God. Best job I've ever had. I worked at a, a part-time job in a drugstore. Yeah. This old lady comes in. She says, sir. So you have cotton balls? So I think I'm a fucking rag dog. The fuck out of here. Cotton balls. Cotton balls. Cotton yeah, balls. Yeah, I get it. Oh, so you cotton didn't really work balls. in a mental institution? No. Oh, I thought I was, like, oh, I was really just going to get into that. <laughs> you gotta get he was in, in the mental institution. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I owned the restaurant 30, 30 years. I owned the restaurant called oh, Guido's. Right. Yeah. Well, you know, so... And it fits in with me, uh, Guido. Now they call me the original Guido. Ah, right, so, right. Uh, so you owned a restaurant called Guido for 30 years. Redneck. Best supper club great in the United night. States. 1979, 1980, 81. Three years. Yeah, great supper night. club would what, have shows? Yeah. yeah what yeah, kind of shows? Uh, piano, bar, you know, like a piano, bar, everything. Supper club, you know. Singing. That sounds nice. <laughs> it's very, it's very nice. Sure. Piano players. The partner just happened to be a single white female. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Older. Now, have you, have, you, have you... I was 20, she was 42. Right. right have you been on Staten Island? You, you born and raised there? or 
I I was born in uh, Sicily. They're oh, both, okay. So, uh, so you were. When we came she came over to Italy. Was, oh, Can you oh, let somebody oh, else talk oh, about oh, you? Oh, 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 that's my sister. Oh, Tell me yeah. shut the of fuck up. Of course, they're both should. That's why when I come on the show, usually it's go like this. Yeah. That's my sister. She told me to shut the fuck up. All right. So Sicily. How old were you when you came over? Ten. Ten years old. <laughs> oh, man. But then she went to Staten Island to my block, Bradley Avenue. Bradley Avenue. And she's my never been off left Bradley the Avenue island. for 36 <laughs> years. I think this is her first time in Manhattan. Right? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> We went to California last month. Yeah, we, we, lived, just... we went to L.A. for like a month. I actually oh, had wow. never been anywhere. anywhere. I went to visit Vinny in uh, Miami for the first time. When we were filming Jersey Shore. Years. First time wow. she got on a plane. Yeah, I had never been anywhere. That... Nowhere. Didn't you get bored, though, just being in the same environment? Doesn't that get like... <laughs> no. There's plenty to cook. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. That's all she did. No. Cook. <laughs> Cook for 30 I would never. Clean. I never wanted to leave my. I had opportunities to go, like vacation and stuff, but mm -hmm. I never would leave my kids. Yeah, yeah. Ever. Even like now we're like forty years old. And yeah, she's still yeah, always, she's still, yeah, not, not leaving my babies. Yeah. Like, she always, always sets a different goal. Yeah, yeah, like okay, yeah. once they graduate college, right. and now what? Once in high school, then college. Right. Now yeah. Yeah. once they get married, married. Right. 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 once she gets divorced. Right. <laughs> Even like work wise, I always work nights because I wanted to be home with them during the day. So even like I used to work nights, nights, you know, whatever. Anyway. What, what did you do for work? I worked in a, <laughs> in in a, a diner. diner for a... Uh, Just like a manager. In the manager diner. in a diner for 22 years. Wow. Same diner. How many drunks but did you see going through plenty, there? Plenty, plenty. <laughs> but I used to work 70 hours, 80 hours a week. <gasps> Up until like... We started filming this show. Ago. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So that Vinny could have his fancy shoes. Yay. <laughs> now you stopped buying them a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> so you how was so how was it going to Miami? I mean that's like alien right. alien yeah. territory. Was, uh, we were only there for three days, right then? <clears throat> When you have so, I think when you're somewhere for so long and you go somewhere yeah. like that, it almost is surreal to you. Yeah, it's almost yeah. like she didn't even remember it. You know? No. I, I didn't. I, I went to the hotel and then to visit you at the house and then to the beach once. Just and get came me back home. to my. She's like, I gotta get back to my stove. Yeah, exactly. That's <laughs> my stove. You, oh my God. California, you're yeah. still? Yeah. You're in California for and a month. That, we had yeah. no choice. I had to stay yeah, in Yeah, we filmed LA. a little of the show in LA. Yeah. Yeah. That was hard. I had a ball at this. Well, yeah, I, well, I don't I doubt mean, you would I'm tear, like tearing it up out there. I'm getting I'm back sure. really quick. <laughs> I'm sure. Were you, were you scared to fly? Yeah. I was. Yeah. I was. Um, sure, a couple Xanax. No. A couple of Xanax. <laughs> yeah. I was better going coming back. I took Xanax. Oh, you did. Yeah. I'm scared to fly. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I hate it. I, left I just sit there through and I kill myself. You I, gotten, I, you, I've kind of gotten used yeah. to it over the years. It got, I got worse. Really? I used to be. Yeah. I used to be great at it. I yeah. used to be. I used to be on a plane when Jersey Show first came out. Three, three to yeah. four times a week. Yeah. Flying to like two, two different cities, doing yeah. like appearances, yeah. and then some reason after a while it just got it got it worse and worse. Started getting to you, really? like, yeah. yeah and now I just hate. It. I dread it. Yeah, yeah. You came home one day. So now you got you something said, to lose. Never <laughs> it's like, damn, I'm doing all right here. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want this plane going. When down. you flew out, did you fly in the front of the plane or the back of the plane? First class. Oh, you went first class? Oh, of course. Vinny put me in the first class. You're nice, first boy. That's not how it always is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's not the good flight. Don't get used to that, Ma. Hey, they put me in the back. He's yeah, in the cargo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 With me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, 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 I'm sure. sure. Oh, the less fuckers you have to play. The yeah. less you yeah. have to play. I'm close to the bathroom, though. I grab, but I take a fish right there. Yeah, I gotta do. I gotta get hypnotized or something. I gotta figure out. You yeah, know. yeah. No, it's, I'm, I'm actually thinking about taking pilot lessons, just to oh. just to become like comfortable with it. Yeah, you know, yeah. Crazy, crazy player, be, right? Exactly. <laughs> That'd be a bad idea. You could do that. Don't watch that Have video fun. from Afghanistan of the seven forty seven. Oh my god! I, I, I didn't. I saw. Oh, it was I, terrible. I watched the movie Flight though. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's a good movie. Yeah, yesterday I guess they came out. A video came out from Afghanistan yeah. of a seven forty seven going down for, on someone's dash cam. They saw it. Holy! It's probably the clearest. Yeah, but they only said like seven people died. Yeah, there was, yeah, it was, it was a, cargo. a cargo plane. Oh, it was a cargo plane. The cargo, cargo plane. wasn't fast and it was slid to the back plane. of the plane when it was taken off and it <laughs> just went. Wah. But it's. Don't uh, worry about that happening wow. in Nino. <laughs> yeah. Back <laughs> 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 to the black of the plane. And... Hey. <laughs> so did you? Now did you have a bad flight or something that fucked you up? Because I've had some scary flights yeah. that kind of made the next one frightening. I've had yeah, I've had like really bad turbulence and. Uh, it made it messed up, but I don't even know if it was that. I can't I remember yeah. when that when you it made literally that decision, just Renny. gradually. The thing with me is, yeah. I've talked about like anxiety in here, right, and stuff, right, right. And the thing with me is that my mind just like doesn't accept ignorance as bliss. 
Uh-huh. Like if I hear something, right, I yep. need to know about it. If I yeah. feel something, I need to know about it. And on a plane, there's so much that you don't know and 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 hear and shit. Where everyone else is just like, oh, I'm gonna play my game, you know, yeah. whatever. You're like, what the fuck yeah, is I'm that? Like, that? What is me, that? Me, I, give, give me more scotch. Why? Is that? Of <laughs> By the scotch. time I hear that, I'm thinking about the next thing, and then another thing. This my adrenaline's thing. on. There's high, you know? so many moving parts on yeah. this thing. But the flight attendant's <laughs> not panicking. A lot of times, I'll, like, like it used to scare me when you take off, and then all of a sudden you hear like. And you feel the engine stop, but I realize yeah. it's just the cabin pressure changing. Like I thought the engine no, well, was they slowing back, down. They, they, they have to for noise. They have to do that. I've like, researched yeah, this whole yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I mean, I thought, I thought the engines were shutting yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. You thought you were about to go. It was I'm just the cabin down. pressure. Yeah. No, you're still going like 600 miles. Yeah, they per hour. pull back. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. Um, I don't I know what it is. Yeah. <laughs> you know what's funny though? When I'm not, when it's like a smooth flight and shit, I'm like having a ball. Yeah. yeah. You know, the landing's my favorite part because I'm like, oh, I'm about to be home. <laughs> hey, here it is. You know, but meanwhile, Where, you know, people are scared about most, that. They're most, like, oh, please hit it. Most crashes are takeoffs and landings. Exactly. So. I'm, I'm the commas. That's where I'm the commas. <laughs> That's your commas. I'm, yeah. I'm, I bug out when we're just like chilling three hours in and then all of a sudden we're just like, like just rocking around. I just, you know, I think everyone has a little problem with uh, the thought of plummeting yeah no one wants to plummet yeah, right yeah. so but no you one know. else is thinking about it no, well, no you know what i'm saying i'm the one that's thinking about it well i'm so. sure there's other people that are that look at you and think uh, he's not thinking about it because you probably hide it yeah i well. do hide you it. know right. you sit there yeah, you're not you freaking out like way. shatner in mm-hmm. twilight zone oh my God, <laughs> it's a man yeah. on the wing by the way, yeah. who conceptualized this show? It's, it's, it's it your a, favorite show, Nino, right? The actually, that little one. guy. That, that, I was every time I, I did that fly in, in the wing or in the back seat, you know? So yeah. So I always I look at the window. I, I expect that little guy to come up, you know? Remember right. the Twilight Zone? Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the man on the wing. Little, he little, just said it. William Shatner. Where is that little fucking guy? They got him. I was doing drugs. I was doing drugs. I'd be like, what the fuck? So, so yeah. I started doing drugs. It was the worst 20 minutes of my life. How was the show conceptualized? Well, basically, I saw to do to improv and I do uh, stand-up comedy like not do it but I did it once <laughs> but I do I, I do UCB so um, I shut up <laughs> so I, when I, I when I went to them now. I said listen I, I want to do something else that's not reality you know and they always put me on their little MTV has a million shows like talking head shows and stuff uh-huh. and I've done acting stuff for them and then they will you know, I guess they saw that there was more than to me than just follow me around and watch me drink and then um <laughs> But the, but America does know me with my family. They know me from Staten Island, so we wanted to incorporate that on. Mm-hmm. on so we're not going to have a sitcom. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, you don't yeah. have to script these people. Yeah. Uh, and then script. plus, I guess the network wanted a place where artists and actors can come promote their stuff, and it's never been done before. So right. we gave it a whirl. Who have you had on besides Lil Wayne? We had uh, Kesha, Mark Wahlberg, Anthony Mackie, ASAP Rocky, Red Fu, uh, Whitney Cummings, Jenny McCarthy. A lot of people, uh, uh, just like a lot of current pop culture MTV one of my favorites, audience one of my favorites people. Was the Tyler the fucking, Tyler the Creator, he's a fucking um, Sierra. Oh, the list is right here. Perez Who Hilton. Was the girl that sat on, got on her knees under the table. Oh, Iggy, oh, Iggy. Azalea. Yeah, what was, oh. that, what was that all about, man? I came in. That's where I came in tea, and you were under the fucking table. <laughs> well, no, this girl Iggy Azalea. You ever hear of her? No. She's like a. She's like this tall Australian. She's like seven feet tall. <laughs> Wilhelmina, she's a model, but she's like a gangster rapper, uh-huh. and uh, she's hot. She good? She's hot, but she was trying to like feed me, and she couldn't reach the table. We'd never chair, so she got on her knees, and oh. I'm like, like literally yeah. five seconds into the interview, and I'm like, this is awesome, you know? Yeah. What I mean? Like five minutes, the girl's Why on she her, doing knees. her knees. What? Why is she doing on her knees? She, she was, was like tall, spreading. So that's how she reached the table. My mother had a heart attack, but Jenny McCarthy was like in my bedroom in my bed that oh. I grew up in. She was what? very forward. Yeah, is it she like, was is very it... forward. Yeah, they nice. kept me out of that she episode. They forward. kept me out. They kept me in the fucking garage. Has I, I, you were <laughs> saying me in the house? <laughs> you were saying before that everybody's been respectful or anything, but has anybody done anything that you were kind of like, oh, well, this is yeah. my house? Well, the the women. Yeah, uh, McCarthy. Well, Jenny McCarthy. Yeah, she started she spoke. talking about SCX. <laughs> SCX. Oh, she would never say sex. She would never say sex. Say sex. Well, that's a little. Say what you want to say, yeah. and I'll say what I want. To say. Oh, oh, hey! Oh, she always no. fucking gives it to me. <laughs> she always fucking gives it to me. <laughs> God damn, you know. You didn't, you, but you didn't like the dirty talk. You don't mind a little I mean, cursing, you know but the what? dirty I talk. I had my daughter on one side. <laughs> nah. I have a daughter who's 20. Who my do- my, my sister hasn't yeah. dated All yet. <laughs> so 21, they're not allowed to date. Oh. Yeah. And, you know, they respect that. My older daughter's 28 now. 
And now she says, Mommy did the right thing. And this one is 20, and she hasn't dated yet. Wow. Even though she likes a boy, now I know. Uh-oh. Uh, White kid? But she's going to be 21 <laughs> yeah, in February. All right. I mean, what are you crazy? <laughs> the most serious question anyone's ever asked. Never seen you respond like that. You know. I have no idea. No, Stop, bro. You're on TV. Your mother wouldn't go for that. She's into a guy. She's just going to permission now. Is it a white guy? Oh. And, and Nina's like, what the yeah. fuck? Yeah. Oh. Come on, of course. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what are you talking about? What the fuck is that better? What the fuck is? You know what? It's white. 2013, Nina. Matter. Come on. It doesn't matter? No, I'm, I'm not. I I'm, like dark girls. Like you wouldn't that. care, though, your little I girl? I think it's shutting the dark all the time. <laughs> your little girl comes home with dark. a black guy. <laughs> normally, if you look it at a, the average on... of Italian families, they don't want their little girl coming home with a black guy. No, we don't really discriminate. You know I, I know. Mean, if, if it made her happy. He, I was It'll always told, because we don't that, discriminate. That, 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 sure. I don't sure. Open, sure. Oh, my gosh. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my hey, yeah. gosh. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Is he gonna man. shut up any or no? Uh, nah. Anyway, so mm-hmm. we be. I think what happened was I figured it out like forty years later because uh-huh. I'm here. I'm fifty three, forty three years. Anyway, when I came to America, I didn't speak a word of English. None of us did. So, by coincidence, the neighbor like. Uh, um, th- my grandfather lived on Bradley. The neighbor was a black family, African American, mm-hmm. and also on the other side. And these people really, if it wasn't for them, a girl named Deborah, I've really heavy, heavy. S- I had never seen a black person. Oh, I wow. I swear to God. I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seen- you go. Ne- oh, my God. Finney's getting so nervous with this conversation. I know. A black person. Uh-huh. And, and uh, Deborah, she used to put me on the bus every morning, take me to the bus stop. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on? I love this. It's a nice story. Vinny's, I know, I know, I know. Vinny's yeah. hyperventilating. He's panicking. Why? He's watching his MTV I don't deal know. disappear. It's a, it's a sweet story. <laughs> for anyway, so later on, on in, no, but anyway, so later on in life, yeah. I had people tell me people that I really didn't care for too much. Yes. They used to tell me, "Oh, you're like that because you're an immigrant too," you know, and and you know you were. Uh, you were um, a, what? A, mi- a minority. Right. So that's why I don't discriminate, and uh-huh. I don't, you know, which is bullshit, probably. <laughs> but <laughs> maybe right, that, that had something story. to do with maybe it. Maybe it did. I don't know. She yeah. put you on the know. bus. Yeah, your first yeah. experience with black people yeah, was pleasant. Pleasant, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, <golly. laughs> she made sure every morning she used to come to the house, take me yeah. by the hand. Yeah. <laughs> you too, Nino. Oh, you my know? God. <laughs> How did you grow? Up? How did you grow up with this guy? How did you grow up? You know up what? With this it's guy? always been like this. Has I it swear always, to God. right? Yes. That's why my father used to beat the shit out of me. Oh really? Yeah. Did he, uh, got beat a lot. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> Yeah, my to get father the strap? was. Yeah, yeah the my strap. father yeah, was tough. The buckle, everything. Oh, oh yeah. man, yeah. only him. Me, I wonder six. why. I don't know, just me. Yeah, I wonder why. So <laughs> how, how did he react when he was getting beaten? Huh? He still did. He took it. Yeah. He said, hey, yeah, you no hit choice. me. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I Yeah. Everything's just there. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, he did used to talk to him like that. He said, what are you doing? He couldn't run. Oh, shit. Bob, what the fuck? You had to take it with daddy. Holy shit. Yeah, I had to take it with somebody. So I was going to look great. It didn't work anyway. Yeah. Well, uh, yeah, we're, 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 about, we're about through oh, for the day. Um, <laughs> stay tuned for... I'm sorry to bring no wine today. Sorry. Oh, that's to okay. No yeah, yeah, that's hey, stuff. Hey, what's my buddy Opie? Who's Opie? Opie, uh, he's taking care of his, uh, his kids. Got a little I was flu. Say, I was the kid. He's his kid's got a little flu, so okay. he was up all night so with the, the kid. He's the nurse. He's the nurse. So he, yeah, yeah, you <laughs> know how it is. Let him tell us about our show. Shut up. It's called... It's called The Show. Shut the fuck up. The Show with Vinny premieres this Thursday, May 2nd, tomorrow night. It's 10 o'clock on MTV, 
And, uh, you know, it's been... No matter what race you are, watch it. Exactly. Yeah, it's all inclusive. Yeah, absolutely. Right? You know. it it's an show. international show. Everybody can watch it. Yeah. Yes. It's uh, it's obviously a very entertaining family, and, uh, you know, I would certainly suggest watching it to oh, see yeah. people kind of come in and mix. It's a, it's a really a different idea. Oh, for a show. yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's the, you're thrusting two worlds together, and yeah. it's hilarious. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks for having us. Fantastic. Thanks so much. Your mom's adorable. I love it. And Nino, you're... you coffee sucks, but that's okay. That's pretty good. What the fuck? I'm tied up over it. He's tangled in the headphone cords. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Take care. Take it easy. Very good. Little hugs and kisses going on here. Hey, Nino, how you doing, my friend? Hey, all Sammy, right, my friend. You know, you take know, care, huh? White albino. White albino. There it is. He's, he's saying his goodbyes to Roland. <laughs> and uh, out the... There he goes. Take it easy, my friend. Holy shit. He's an entertaining guy, though. He I really mean. is. Yeah, yeah. I know, he is. He's a, he's, he's a nice guy. I, I like I like him with the contrast of Vinny and, and his mom. Because, yeah. uh, you know, his mom just telling him to shut the fuck up. It's hilarious. Vinny was hey, like, my sister told me shut the fuck up. We're he, gonna... he was really in a panic when his mom started yeah. telling the story about the black family that lived yes, next door. Yes, yes. You know, he was worried that fucking you know, was going to blurt something well, out. Yeah. Well, if <laughs> well, you remember... He his quiet. Yeah. And then TV guy goes, oh, he, Uncle Nino's very quiet. I was like, oh, yeah, sure this, he is. This way, this way. Now, Nino, uh, <laughs> if you remember, he was telling some some off-color jokes a few times back when he was in, and Vinny was just like, because he just sees his whole career going down the shitter but yeah. because his fucking uncle blurted something stupid yeah. out. In this day and age, they don't care.